So Sue, what does caring for children with Down syndrome, I guess, do to you in your life? Um, provide for you in your life? Yeah, well, I think, well, certainly since we lost Sarah, it's sort of given us a lot back. We had this beautiful world that Sarah was a part of with us that she created, and I think that having the boys in our lives has brought that back to us. So it's a, um, it sort of breaks it down to being quite simple, um, quite innocent, quite pure, and, um, I mean, yeah, we have a our days and our moments and that type of thing but I think generally it's just a it's a beautiful world to live in it's it's um they're just lovely children yeah and how important do you think it is for communities to recognize events like international um Down syndrome day I think it's very important because I think that you know if you're armed with knowledge you can do so much more you can advocate a community can advocate for you know people with disabilities within that community I think it's very important that um, people band together and support the, the, the children. I mean, we have that. We have that already like, within the community. We, you know, uh, Russell and Hayden are quite well known in the community and um, very well supported and, and they expect that from the community. They expect to sort of be recognised and to be known for who they are and regardless of their disability. So how would you That's describe the relationship between Hayden and Russell? Like any other relationship, I think, between brothers, they have their moments, they have their spats, and they'll, um, you know, um, fight over things. Bef before Russell started preschool, it was a matter of just handing things over to Hayden, but since he's been at preschool, I think it's more a case of that's mine and I want it back and I'm not going to let you have it. And so we're sort of seeing a little bit more, um, yeah, disputes going on in the household and that kind of thing, which is, it's, it's normal. It's, it's fun. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, okay. Sue. Thank that's you.